I could not let my leaves or like greens just be in peace for like one minute. Look at how, look at how they're demolishing. Okay, so I just ordered a hot dog, I think. I don't know, I didn't understand anything. What the fuck? Good morning, guys. This is day two of my Taiwan trip. And right now I'm in Ilan, Ludong. Ludong, I think it's called. Ludong, I'm just trying to say Ludong to people, but they're like, what are you talking about? So I think it's pronounced like, something like that but yeah pretty excited to be here because i saw that a bit like outside of ludong there's like a farm that has capybaras and llamas and i have never seen a real capybara or a real llama in my entire life so i would like to go there but first i need to get some breakfast let's go ahead and eat some good taiwanese breakfast let's go Alright, it's an awesome morning in Dong and I just ordered a sandwich, some sandwiches and some night cha. It was so hard to order because I mean they only spoke uh, Mandarin and I couldn't understand what they were saying so I had to use Google Translate. Too too hard. I of course can say like night cha for example. I understand what that's what that means, but it's still hard to me. I just can't like hear all of the words they're saying because they're speaking so fast, it's so hard for me. But nevertheless, never mind. I need to eat a good sandwich at the start of the day. So let's try it. I have no idea what's in here. I think it's like ham, tomato and pork. Looks pretty good. So to try the night char. Anyhow, that's a good night char. That was some good for breakfast. And like it was so awkward because like after I asked them like, uh, do you have a toilet? And I tried to say it in Mandarin. I tried to say like ni yao chie su chie su ma. And they were just like, what? Use Google Translate, bro. I don't understand you. And I was like, okay. Uh, you know what? That's, I think that's fair enough. I mean, like, now I'm super excited to actually go to the uh, Capybara farm and see what animals they have there. I just want to see some goofy animals. I've seen so many, like, yeah, TikTok videos and YouTube videos about Capybaras, and now I'm actually going to see one in real life. So that's going to be awesome. But yeah, let's get to the farm. Ah. Where the hell am I right now? It's like out of nowhere. What the fuck? Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> hungry, ah, hungry, ah. Get it, get it. So many animals, what's going on? going on. <laughs> <laughs> I swear, there are so many animals here. It's crazy. That guy, he just bumps into me like every time. It's so fun being here, but it's just so hard to film because there are just an animals like all over me, like all of the time. No way! But I'm trying to give a kabibaba some food. You like it? One, one more? Oh. <laughs> I swear this guy is hunting me. Are you hunting me, bro? Yay. You like it? Is it wa kao chao hao chi? I think, I think, oh <laughs> chill. Happy bow. Happy bow. Look at him. He's just, he's like, he's just chilling like that. Yo, chill, bro. Chill. Okay, let's try and feed the turtles. No, bro, don't take his food. 
sneaky ass took it all, I swear. This oh. just placed all of my leaves, all of my leaves on a bench, like here, because I want to feed the turtle. And look at how many animals there are just feasting on my on my greens, like what's going on? I think they're on their bulking season right now, but I could not let my leaves or like greens just be in peace for like one minute. Look at how look at how they're demolishing this. Yo, bro, I'm gonna feed the turtle this, okay? I know, I know you want it, but I'm gonna feed the turtle this, okay? Get a little bro. How did a ca capybara get in here? What's going on? Mm. Is it good, bro? Is it wakao? Oh, okay, well, I think he's gonna eat me. Uh, I better. I gotta move. I just feel that I'm in Kebibara heaven. So cute. They even got a slough here. It's crazy. I'm gonna say hi to bro. Look, he's just like me. <laughs> All right, let's feed him. What? Can I just? <laughs> it's a cow, chow hao chi. Yeah, what cow, chow hao chi, right? What the fuck? <laughs> And the next awesome thing is that you can get free sweets. So I got me a donut here and let's try it. It's good, it's a lot like different compared to like the donuts that I eat in Denmark and in America, but it's it's really good, just in a different way. Just more like Asian style donut, but it's still wakao. That was such a fun trip. It's so fun being in there and just petting the um, pets. I must say that I was a bit scared of petting them, so I just, you know, fed them food instead. Because no way I'm gonna get eaten, no way my finger is gonna get eaten by a turtle or some shit like that. They're actually like pretty big, they could probably do some damage to you with those big teeth they have. But yeah, it was so fun being in there and the donut that I got was also pretty good. It's nice, but I just don't know where I am now, like. But now I wanna explore one of the parks here. Ludong has like a cultural park that I'm gonna see here in a minute. Or probably like 20 minutes because I need to get back to the main city. Yeah, I'm excited and I wanna go there. But probably after I'm gonna visit maybe the night market. But it's just like too early right now. I really like just wanna go around more, but there's just like the distance between like all of the nice attractions is so far. So it's kind of like hard for me because I don't like drive. I don't have a scooter or anything like that. So I have to pay an Uber like all of the way and it's gonna cost me like <laughs> so much money. <laughs> but uh, I hope that I can see most of the nice things here. All right, now I'm at the Ludong Cultural Park. Honestly, just from the outside look, already looks beautiful. So uh, let's go in there. You know what, guys? A thing that I wish would be here would be the Happy Bowers. Honestly, like, I already missed them so much. I just want to go back and just see their goofiness. <laughs> I think this park was really beautiful. The places that I've been at, like Taipei and Geelong, I don't think they have such beautiful parks. And I don't know like, if they do have like some nice parks in anywhere else here in Taiwan. Yeah, they probably have, because I read about the, uh, I don't know if I can pronounce it right, the Walin, the next county that I'm going to. They have a park there that should be pretty beautiful. But I think like this is a really nice, like small cultural park here in Ludong. I don't think I still pronounce it correctly. Yeah, it was really nice and I met some cool fans there and met a nice a nice bro that also watches my videos. So I had a little talk with him, it was really nice. He actually lives in the Walin, so I asked him like, ah, should I go to that, that like city? Because I was thinking about going to some urban cities. Maybe I'm just gonna go to Walin city. I'll figure out uh, where I'm gonna go later. But I think right now I'm going to maybe <laughs> ask some more people, maybe do like a little challenge. Maybe ask someone to go to a date with me, or maybe I should do that later in maybe Tainan or some or Taichung because there are a lot more people there. Oh, but maybe I should do a challenge. I just I just don't know what the challenge should be. 
Oh, okay, so I just thought about a thing. I'm gonna try to order a hot pot for the first time because there is a hot pot like right next to me. So I gotta practice my Mandarin. So I need to say, okay, ding yi fen ho go ma. Okay, ding yi fen ho go ma. Okay, ding yi fen ho go ma. That doesn't sound right, but let me try to go there. Okay, you know what, guys? Let's, let's try this place. I think they have Hong Guo here. All right, let's go. Sorry, can I buy a hot pot here? Is that possible? Shit, <laughs> shit. <laughs> All right, interesting menu. I don't understand anything, so I'm gonna have to use Google Translate. God damn. Uh, yeah, that one. Yeah. Mm. Um, yeah. <laughs> what? Wait, wait, wait. Okay, let me see. Oh, okay. Mi fun? Ah, okay. Yeah. Yeah. This. Ah, okay. Shishi, thank you. Okay, so I just ordered a hot pot, I think, I don't know, I didn't understand anything, but uh, I used Google Translate all of the way. What the fuck? What am I gonna do? Like, help me make a hot pot, please. Guys, what is the first step? So I have to put the meat on the pot, put it all in the pot. Okay, okay, I'm gonna put the vegetables in first. Wait, just all of it, all of it. Okay, all right, I, I think that I've made my hot pot now. Also made my sauce, and it kind of looks pretty gross. <laughs> I don't know if it's even like meant to be like sauce for the meat, but look. And honestly, like the thing that I took for my drinks, I don't even know if it's for drinks. I just give up, I just want to eat something. Let's try this, um, maybe hot pot. Let's try Anton's hot pot. All right. And my weird sauce, let's dip it in. I don't know how it's gonna taste. Maybe it's gonna taste like ass, maybe it's gonna taste like some godly food that I also make. Maybe it's gonna be good, I don't know. But one thing I know that I, is that I can't really use chopsticks for small things. Honestly, like, it's not half bad. It could be a lot better, but kind of um, the taste is kind of weird. Oh, bye bye. But um, I mean, it's not the worst. But I thought it maybe it would taste kind of like Korean barbecue. Actually. I probably need someone to help me make this because I don't think I've made it correctly at all. But at least I uh, I got some food. Yeah, let me eat this and then I'm gonna go to the night market. So I'll see you guys soon. Hey, <laughs> anyhow. So I have a question for you guys. Okay. What do you think about this city? Is it nice? Is it boring? What is, mm, do you like it? I like this, but it's too boring. But here ah. the air is really good and ah. the nature is really pretty. I like. I pay better. Right, but the, <laughs> but the nature is good though. Yeah. So I'm gonna try the Bing Cha, is it called? Yeah, Bing Chi Ling. Bing Chi Ling Cha or something, yeah, yeah. Okay, let's go. It's pretty good. It tastes like tea. Yeah. It's so weird to taste like tea in ice cream, I think. Uh, hen Hao. Hen Hao Chi. Hen Hao Chi, right. Mm. A super Hen Hao. Super. Chao Ji Hao Chi. Okay, okay. <laughs> yeah, it has also been a good day because I've met a lot of fans and they have it has just been super super nice to me. Just enjoy talking to them, it has been so awesome and that has made my day. Honestly, like when I meet fans they always make me happy, they always like make my day because like I'm just like so grateful for all of you and I'm grateful that you want to watch my videos. So Shishi, thank you guys a lot. I'm at the night market now and it's kinda early, but I have to go traveling to the next place, so I'm gonna see if there are some fans here or if there is not I'm gonna go and take the train to the next station or not not to the next station but to the next place that I'm going and that's Walin all right but that's it for this video today I think it has been really really fun here in Ludong I, I still can't pronounce it right but 
I, I think it has been really, really fun. I really like how the city looks. I really like the nature here. But I'm gonna go to the next place now. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. This is actually a really unlucky day because I just found out that the railway has been closed because of rain. So yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know what I'm gonna do with my trip because I should have been to Hulian now and Pingtung, I think it's called. And I probably have to skip those cities this time because on a pretty like strict uh, schedule, I have to yeah visit 16 cities in 16 days because. I have to be on a show here soon and I have to do some other things and it's like the day after or two days after that, I, that I'm coming home from the like whole trip and I can't waste any time, I can't waste any days so I'm pretty sad about it. Alright guys, I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.